After competing in the 1988 Summer Olympics in Seoul, a local man is using his grit and determination to help with a major local bridge tunnel expansion. He is the traffic control manager for the HRBT project and also finished in the top 10 for trap shooting at the Olympic Games. Then to your side's Amy Avery tells us he's using his skills now to help keep traffic on track. Eh? Amy? Well, Tom, Brian Ballard says there are a lot of similarities from working on this big project to training for the Olympics. He says you have to work with a team, be a little competitive, sometimes deal with setbacks, and of course, be dedicated to the task at hand. Maintenance of traffic manager for the HRBT project, Brian Ballard, has a pretty cool day job. You've probably seen the orange barrels or temporary barriers on the roadway as you drive across the bridge tunnel. Well, he's the guy in charge of all the crews working to maintain traffic flows. But 36 years ago... These are the ranges. He was competing in trap shooting at the 1988 Olympics in Seoul, South Korea. Exactly. And there he is right as he's lighting the torch. He says the opening ceremony was the coolest part. When you walk into that stadium, especially as a U.S. athlete, it's, uh, it's indescribable. Ballard made his first All-American team at the age of 13 and went on to make five All-American teams in total, then made the U.S. shooting team. He was on the team for 13 years, competing in a couple world championships. And I was fortunate enough to win the doubles event there. Three Pan Am games and finished ninth at the 1988 Olympics. It's so many mixed emotions. It's relief that you've made it, yet you realize that you're going to go into uh, probably the toughest competition of your life. Ballard grew up in a small town in northern Idaho and says trap opened a lot of doors for him. So watching the games on TV now brings back a lot of memories. Shot the world championships in Moscow, Russia in 1991. I mean, I've shot in Cuba back in the Castro era. Uh, South America, Europe, East Asia, I've shot all over the world. A journey with a lot of milestones, making the team, training for the games, breaking a certain score, something that translates to his day job now helping you navigate as you drive across the Hampton Roads Bridge Tunnel. The dedication and the time that it takes to make that Olympic team, and you just, you never give up. Well, it's the same thing here. You know, we go through our struggles, tough times, things that you have to overcome, issues you have to overcome. You never give up. Amy Avery, 10 on your side.